And in the Davis School District, an elementary principal is asking all sixth grade parents to help track down and stop a cyber bully. The bully has created a TikTok account that appears to be linked to Foxborough Elementary in North Salt Lake. That's where Debbie Worthen joins us live tonight. And Debbie, what have you learned so far? Well, it all started on Monday when TikTok accounts started surfacing that started circulating around the school targeting and bullying students here. Now, the principal first met with the sixth graders and then he sent out the email to their parents. It said the ugliest and most pick me person in the school and shot a picture of me. She and her mom won't go on camera for fear of retaliation, but want these TikTok accounts shut down. I called law enforcement that night. So does the principal at Foxborough Elementary in Davis School District, who sent an email to every parent of a sixth grader here. It says in part, I desperately need your assistance in talking to your child about something of immediate importance. This morning, we were made aware of seven created pages with hurtful messages and pics of our own kids and teachers. This is not okay by any means, and we are investigating. He continues by saying these pages are created from outside the district and not during school hours. Still, he knows his students are seeing the messages and are reporting them as they are targeted. The student and her mother we talked to appreciate the email and the urgent call to action. Because he came to our classes like, this is unacceptable. He then pulled the student aside to make sure she was okay. When I saw it, I was like crying to my teacher. Her mom is devastated. Words can't explain. It's, it's heartbreaking. It's hurtful. Now, we have been told that one of the other mothers has reached out to TikTok to have those accounts suspended or shut down. As of airtime tonight, those accounts are still active. Also, Utah anti-bullying laws cover off-campus bullying, and they prohibit cyberbullying anytime, anywhere. Back to you. All right, Debbie Worthen, live for us this evening. Debbie, thank you.